Oh, go away, go away, go away, go away, go away, go away. What's up, everybody, and welcome back to The Unfinished Swan. I am John Michael with AOG, and we are going to continue our story. Uh, and into the white canvas we go. I'm excited about uh, hurrying up and finishing up this series. want to get down to the bottom of this storyline and uh, pick up another game. Get that rolling. Look at that slow drip of a vine. Gosh, this game's white. I was going to say kind of pretty, but like, I don't know if that's the word to describe it. Alright, so swords and shields, a ham, and we have our vine here. Hmm, okay. Alrighty, righty, 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 righty. Let's figure out... Even half finished, the creature oh, had Lord. no trouble swallowing up all the king's soldiers, half his zoo, and three peppermint gazebos. It was only with the help of his pet hippo and the giant that the king was able to force it into the sea. And though the water remained black for years after, the creature was never seen again on shore. Peppermint gazebos? So I know what a gazebo is, and I know what peppermint is. Peppermint gazebo, the together? All right, you do you. Do I have to fight this thing? I mean, that would make this game kind of epic. I'm not saying this is a bad game, but it'd be kind of epic. Can I get up there? Mm -hmm. Oh, vineys! Care to help me out? Can you guys? So am I growing like good vines? I don't know. Am I the good of this world? Well, I hope no one was sitting on that. I was like, where am I going? Oh. Freaking Monroe with his back muscles of a freaking god. Way to go, buddy. You may be unfinished, but your mom gave you some muscles. Uh, out the door. Oh, yeah, I'm in a bell tower. Right? It was a bell tower, right? I don't see no bell. I think I hear a bell. Ooh. 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 I don't understand why the cannons have floating balloons. Maybe this will tell me why. Within a short time, the king's subjects had all moved away, except the giant, who was quite loyal and also very lazy. They are hating on this giant, man. We get it. The big guy's lazy. He's got a lot of body mass. Is that toast? I didn't even see that. Was I over there? If there's that much more to explore in this game, I'm not sure what I'm going to do. When, how in the world would I ever get that balloon? I need the fire hose. Oh my gosh. Remember when I said, I didn't hear no bell? I found the bell. It's it's right here. Shut up, Swanfred. Ah, uh, yeah. Well, that's pointless. All right, cool. I found the golden bell. I found the golden bell. Now, we're going to bounce on these balloons, I think. Whee! Boink. 
No boing. Boing. Monroe waved goodbye to the giant and set sail. But no matter how fast he went, the Hi, giant. Was just out of reach. Hope you find your dad. And not for the first time that day, Monroe suspected he was being led somewhere. Then they flew into a cloud, and everything went black. Aw, oh, shit. What a mix up. Am I gonna have white balls now? That's creepy looking. Nighttime. Chapter 3. Nighttime. Oh man. Monroe sailed on in darkness following the swan's voice, but he never saw a thing. Not the stars, not the swan, and certainly not the tree he got stuck in. When the clouds lifted, the swan was gone, leaving Monroe alone in the middle of an immense forest. Since there was nothing else to be done, he jumped. Suicide! <laughs> ah. That's pretty. Oh, starry night. I wonder what my color of my balls are. Ready? Ready? A one, a two, three. They're black. Well, this is not good. How in the world am I supposed to see where I'm going? All right. Also, I think that's the broken king statue that was on that like Kraken Island. You remember when I was like, oh, is that a Kraken? It wasn't a Kraken, it was like an island. Is there like balloons? Oh God, am I gonna like, oh, creepy music. Oh, this is awesome. Okay, less awesome. Wait a minute. I can't see anything. Oh? Oh. Is that a spider web? But okay. I'll go. I'm sorry. Are you brighter now? Oh, magic pear. Show me the way. Oh, I can paint over here. Oh, they don't stay anymore. My black balls are not eternal. Bye, magic pear. I wish I could take you with me. But into the void I go. To the next one. Hey, Swanford. Swanfred, how could you leave me in the dark? Asshole. You big asshole. You big feathery asshole. Oh, I'm sorry. No, please glow. I need you to glow. I'm just, like, I'm, I'm, I'm kind of worried that I'm going to hit one of these. It's going to illuminate, and there's just going to be, like, a monster creeping around me. Like, the... the, the the vine monster thing. Ah, oh, it's so pretty. Look at all the colors. You know, I was afraid that this game was going to get really tedious and kind of boring with all the vines that it was having me do last episode. Uh, this took a very cool turn. A little velociraptor. <laughs> Is that you? Pratt man, are you here? All right. Sorry if I've disturbed anyone's sleep. I'm just trying to fight in the shit king. I got a feeling I got to go in the slog. If I go in there, I'll probably... I said I was going to die. And I was probably right. Listen. You hear that? No. No, you don't. Because my ball never hit nothing. I know like, I know like, I know like it, I don't like it. Oh god. 
Ah! Oh. Ah! Ah! Please! Please, stay back. Stay... Stay the hell back. Ah! Ah! Oh, where do I go? Where do I go? Oh my god. Why did my screen flash red? Hi. Hi. Oh gosh. Oh god, can can we flash back to where I said I don't like spiders? I'm not a spider person, you know? I don't do well with spiders. Cuz I don't like spiders. How do I get there without them like just nagging me? Will you guys go away? Will you guys please go away? Uh I'm dead, 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 I'm dead. Ah No! No! Hey guys! How you doing? My name is Monroe. Got back muscles like a god. Cause I can climb big black balls. Hey buddy! Were you the one who slashed at me? Hey, hey, guy, listen. Listen, I'm uncomfortable with you being so high up there, okay? Alright, so just stay on my field. Who's that? Shut up. Okay, you are... You guys are not nice. Also, I think I'm stuck. Oh, are they afraid of my balls? Oh, this whole time, I could've just been shooting them. Alright. 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 Who's this? Who's here? You guys, you guys, you guys... Ah! Oh, oh, don't, don't go too far. Don't go too far. They're after me. They're after me. Don't go too far. <laughs> My savior orb. Okay, alright. With me you go, with me you go, with me you go. Don't you leave my side, don't look back. Ah, uh, no, no, no. God, this is intense. This shouldn't be this way, this game was so chill. This game was so chill! Back away. Ah, uh, my ball, my ball. Mr. King, why do you live here? Oh, they're back there. Oh no, oh shit. Oh shit, Nitz. Monroe, Monroe, you gotta go. Monroe, you gotta go. Why is there no sprint? Fuck off. Fuck off with your spider legs. No, go away, go away, go away, go away, go away, go away. A cave? Why? No, no, I said go away. Oh, God. Why a cave? Okay, all right. Cave ended. Oh, hey. Simba's Pride Land. All right. The Pride Rock. Pride Rock. That was the name of it. There's literally a web right there. Am I going to get stuck? Is my ball going to get stuck? Oh, oh. I'm sorry. Uh, the river... No, 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 no. Ah, uh, no. Oh, I'm dead. Oh, I'm dead. I'm so screwed. <sighs> Just channel your inner strength. When did this turn into something so terrifying? Literally last episode, I was just like, wow, this is getting really just tedious. I'm just, am I even going to finish the game? I don't know. I don't know about this game anymore. I got this. It's just going to go down the coastline and I'm going to follow it. And I'm not going to get killed by spiders. We're just having 
having a, we're vibing, we're having a good time, we're having a good time. Having a good time. Fuck off. Uh. Oh god. What's happening? <gasps> run, 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 run. It moved on without me. <laughs> oh, hey, a balloon. Hey, Mr. Spider. Ah, oh, Mr. Frog. Oh, don't die, Mr. Frog. I saw one of you get eaten. Slow down, Betty. Your name's Betty. Oh, my cankles. Ah, oh, shit. Betty! Betty the orb. Wait, you're stuck? Do I have to hit you? Oh, I'm sorry, Mr. Gator. Why is everything trying to kill me all of a sudden? Go away, go away, go away, go away now. For the love of God. Okay. Alright. Wasn't too bad. What do I do now? Do I have to go this way? Do you have to go this way? Oh, you think I'm gonna read right now? All right, yeah, probably. The king was tired of creating perfect kingdoms only to attract less than perfect subjects. He decided he'd have to leave a legacy the old-fashioned way, with a family. Oh. So he began to build one, starting with a house. Well, that's sweet. Also, though, you're assuming that your kingdoms were actually perfect, and they weren't. They were actually imperfect, unfinished even. And so then your subjects would also be less than perfect and unfinished. Therefore, less than however, they treated you like shit. So, but you also treated them like shit. And you created a vine monster by accident. All right, Betty the orb, let's go. Betty, left, go. Betty, I'm not playing around. We gotta go. Spiders of doom. Death and despair. <sighs> Betty. Go. Go down the hole. Come on. We're almost there, I think. Uh. Fuck off. Some more story over there. I should have grabbed a sword. All right. Huh. The king had never had much luck with people, so instead of trying to find a wife, he painted one. When she opened her eyes, the king was astonished. He had created a female version of himself. The king was in love. M Mumsy, is that you? Mum? Mum, were you created from a shit king? A shit pop king? Alright, um. Is there anything else over here? It's worth looking at. Oh! Oh man, I want to go in there so bad. But also, screaming in terror for the viewers the content, you know, as they say. And what is this? Huh? Uh-huh. All right, well, that's... I don't think I can go in there yet. May have to come back. May have to go into the, uh... the window here to do, do something. Can I get that? Did, what? Okay, I was about to say, I did not come over here and get that balloon. Alright, into this world. Aw, home.
Hello, 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 hello. Hello, hello, hello. No, no, nothing. All right, cool. Cool, 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 cool. This is pretty. What in the geometry? I just have magic geometrical. Wow, oh, they can't be too far, okay. Alright. This game is this game is crazy. Let's walk on this now. What in the hell of it? You mean to tell me you can't get yourself... You could climb vines for hours, but you can't jump up this little... It's just slightly too big. You really want me to use the new geometric creation function, don't you? Don't you? Don't! Yeah, okay. That's petty. <laughs> Just let me up. I get it. I have to create things. Oh, hey. It's the thing you drew. It's the thing you drew. Do I go back through there? Or what do I do here? I don't want to create your shape. Oh. Steppy step. What was that? So like, no, I don't have the power. God, what happened here? Poor king, man. We just wanted a family. Bursting with joy, the king locked Bursting. himself in his workshop painting gifts for his queen. He never saw her lack of interest, though she made no effort to hide it. The only gift she kept was his first, a little silver paintbrush. May I have the silver paintbrush? I thought you glue brighter. Did I just change your direction of your glow? The nursery. Ooh. Oh. It's like blueprints. Okay. Well, I think I'm gonna end this episode here. What an unexpected turn this this game has taken. Oh my gosh. Um so nice. Yeah, no, I really, really thought this game was actually kind of getting a little bit dry. Um, especially the last episode and the vines. And like, those puzzles were a bit challenging and there had moments where I was just like, oh my god, this took me way too long to figure out and everything. But the vines just seemed like such a huge element. I'm like, okay, surely this has got to be the end of it. Um, or at least, like, this has got to be, like, the peak of this game. And then this happened and uh, I almost died by spiders. So anyway, that's gonna do it for this episode. In the next episode, hopefully I won't die by spiders um, or get eaten or chased or anything. This whole blueprint thing is kind of neat and creating what I create in this canvas world uh, ends up coming into the real world, if you can call it that. Um, that was wild. 
I think we only have maybe two more, three more episodes of this, so I'm really excited to get this finished up. But anyway, I will see everyone in the next episode of The Unfinished One. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you.